Hi, I'm Sergeant Sue of the San Diego Police Department Recruiting Unit. Thank you for checking out our video of the Physical Abilities Test, also known as the PAT. Our department has revised the physical requirements needed to become a police recruit. and now mimics the California Post work sample test battery that's done in the police academy. And it consists of the following five tests. A 99 yard obstacle course, a 150 pound dummy drag, a six foot solid wall climb, scaling a six foot chain link fence, and a 500 yard run. And now we will demonstrate each test. This is the 99 yard agility course. This simulates a short foot pursuit that may occur in a parking lot. You'll be required to make frequent changes in direction while running as fast as possible. There are curves you need to step over and not touch. There's also a 34 inch workhorse where you must place both hands on top of the obstacle before vaulting over. If you only use one hand, that will be a DQ. To finish off the course, you're gonna sprint straight through the very end. This is the dummy drag event. It simulates moving someone who is physically incapacitated. You're required to lift and drag the 150 pound dummy that's lying face up on the floor while you move backwards. Must be lifted and dragged 32 feet and do not stop until the dummy crosses the red line. There are three ways to pick up and carry the dummy under the armpits, using the chest straps, or interlocking your hands. This is a six foot chain link fence. You will start five yards behind the fence. When instructed to begin, you'll run up and scale the fence and then continue to run towards the finish line 25 yards away. This is a six foot solid wall. Again, you will start five yards behind the wall and scale the wall in any method you want. Do not touch the sides and sprint 25 yards. Here are two additional methods to get over the six foot solid wall. This is the duck walk. To use a duck walk, you're gonna grab the top of the wall with your hands and then walk up the wall with your feet until you get high enough where you can hook your leg over and get over the wall. The third method is the chicken wing. In order to do the chicken wing, you're gonna jump as high as you can, pin your armpit on top of the wall, swing your leg over and hook it to the other side. Then roll over the wall. The last test of the day will be the 500 yard run. This test simulates a long distance foot pursuit that requires you to run 500 yards. Try running at a consistent pace that allow you to complete this test quickly. There's a cone that marks a halfway point and you must run around it before turning around. Make sure you run all the way through to the finish line. And that's it for the physical abilities test. Keep in mind on your official test day, that these tests may be done in any order with the exception of the 500 yard run. That will be completed last. It's important that you go 100% on each one of these tests to ensure that you have enough points to pass. If you need to come down to practice, our recruiters will be here at NTC once a week to help you go through each test. To find the dates and times of the test, please visit us on our website at www.joinsdpdnow.com. Thank you and good luck.